<clears throat> this is David at Barnyard Bees. We've got a swarm coming in from some of my hives over there. One of those 10 frames that I just had checked. And they're just settling in. And when they do, I'm going to shake them. Looking pretty good. So I'm going to give them a second to calm down and I'm going to get me a nuke and shake some bees. We'll be right back. Okay, here we are. I've got my box set up. Grab my limb. This should be a decent shake, I hope. Let's see what happens. Look how far that limb come back up from all those bees. Let me get a lid. Didn't even get a lid. Sorry about this, folks. I wasn't prepared for this video. It just kind of happened. So we'll see. I'll wait on the lid because there's a lot of bees right there. Maybe we can get them to march on in that box. Hold on a second, folks. Okay, what I did, I got my trusty smoker out and smoked them off of that top to get them to go down in the box where I didn't squish them. And what's closer? See how they're panning. So I lucked out and got the queen on the first shake. Of course, it was a pretty low limb. That limb was actually probably, it was right here. Right here's the limb. And that's four foot. That thing hung that limb down four foot to the ground. So, I did put a little veil on, but in doing that, I did not take the first sting on the arms. I have a tank top on and sandals. I did put an old cheap veil on just, just in case, but they was extremely gentle. Not the first sting, not the first nothing. They was, and of course, uh, swarms are very docile. They're very gentle. and. But some of them aren't. Did one last year and it stung me a good 20 times probably. But but they weren't barnyard bees. So what it was, that was in another yard. <laughs> but this looks very successful. Sorry about the traffic folks, it's right we're right by the road. It looks like they're, I've not seen any of them. That was probably the most successful shake I've, already, I've ever done in a swarm. Not a one of them went back up to the limb. Probably because it was so far away from the ground. There's a, well, there's a couple up there just flying around, but that's usually, even after getting a queen, they'll still, a bunch go back to that limb, but they're, they're all going right back in that box. And when I shook them, probably 90% of them fell in the box. So, so they look good there. We're in good shape. That was a good size swarm there. Probably, I'm guessing four or five pounds at least. That was a big swarm. It was, 
it was big as altogether big as a basketball at least but i want to catch that on camera i want to share that with everybody you don't find nice big and i just happened to look over here i was doing i was gathering up nukes to sell and when i drove over here with my truck i saw them in the air then i thought i don't know where they're going i didn't know if they was going across the road but then I looked over and saw them accumulating on that limb. I thought, yeah, we got them in a good location here. Well, that's about it. They're in the box. or going in the box. That was a good shake. I put in some... Actually, I just had some old comb over there. and uh, I made three of them starter strips. Because they're in drawing mode right now. And they'll draw those out extremely fast. And the other two were just old, old combs that I found over there really quick. So... We're in good shape. Thanks for watching Barnyard Bees. Please like and subscribe. Thank you.